Major security breach forcing the government to shut down one of its most sensitive nuclear weapon sites tonight. Take a look at this picture. Authorities say she is the reason why. An 82-year-old nun who they say cut through fences, got past high-tech security. Why? And what does this say about how secure our nuclear sites truly are? Here's ABC's David Curley now. I am Megan from Nevada. Sister Megan Rice and two others did what no one should be able to do. As part of an anti-nuclear protest, they brazenly broke into one of the country's highest security facilities, the site of protests in the past. The target, the country's largest stockpile of uranium for nuclear bombs in Oak Ridge, Tennessee. In the middle of the night, using bolt cutters, the three breached the perimeter fence and then three more fences and motion detectors, reaching the building holding all that uranium, splashing blood on it and raising two banners before guards, who have the authority to shoot to kill, finally arrested the three. You have to be a little concerned when it's, you know, an octogenarian nun who helps you understand your nuclear weaknesses and security. Such a massive breakdown in security that the facility is shut down tonight. Already the government admits there were security execution deficiencies. Government officials declined our request for an on-camera interview. So how can three peace protesters break into one of the country's most heavily guarded facilities? That's a good question, a government spokesman told us on the phone. He added that the break-in was not good, but the government insists the intruders were not even close to getting into the building. Still, an extremely embarrassing lapse in these tense times. David Curley, ABC News, Washington.